of the great things about working, about working in, in the Google G Docs and or really any of the, the G Suite apps. And with the ability to assign tasks, it makes it even more rich. In order to assign a task, highlight an area and go to leave a comment. But don't just leave a comment, include a person. To do that, put the plus sign and then type the person's name. This will give you a drop down option of everyone in your domain. And then you can see underneath here, there's a whole bunch of little verbiage around what it happens when you assign to someone. And notice, unlike when I leave a normal comment, when I click the blue assign button, a blue bar appears at the top saying who it was assigned to. So I made the comment, I can resolve it, but I also assigned it to myself in this case. And when I'm done, I can click here, really nifty. But what if I need to find out what's been assigned to me? Well, as you can see in grid view, there's a little number one on the, on the little screenshot of what I've done or in list view, there's a little number one in a gray circle beside the task. So this is really, really helpful. I love this, but then I wonder, well, how do I know when something's been assigned? If I have all of these folders and stuff everywhere, where can I find my assigned tasks? Easy, go to the Omni box, click the little triangle, go down to follow up and choose action items only. Simply click on the search and you'll notice only documents or slides or whatever you've been, um, have had tasks assigned to you will appear. And you can see, I clicked on this one. If I say resolved and I go back, when I refresh, it's gone, nothing more assigned. And again, when I go to my drive, and I search again because it does lag sometimes I find, hit search, it's gone completely. So it's a really nifty way of finding exactly what you need to do in your drive. Hope this helps and now you know.